Hello YouTube and welcome to this video. In today's video what I'm gonna show you how to do is port forward on a Netgear router because I got my new router now and I have a Netgear router now. So what you wanna do is oops they open the wrong screen like that and you wanna type in this line in your search bar. Um, we just do it again because uh, like this because you need to log in or well yeah there is you will get prompted with a login sign up here um, and the default uh, for Netgear is admin as username and passwords as password so that's quite easy um, what you need to do then for power forwarding port forwarding is go to advanced and then advanced setup and then down here is port forwarding and port triggering you click on that you will get to this side and as you can see I have already two here this uh, one is for my micro server it's fatal network um, the uk.to that's the IP and uh, th this is the Minecraft server itself and if you um, do it with 25565 as the port you don't need the colon 25565 because that's just the default and Minecraft just accepts it if this is the default so you don't need to type the other things uh, and the other one is the vote uh, I, uh, the vote port so this is the default vote port I just set up to my uh, PC that is running my other PC that is running the server so if you if you go in here uh, you would click uh, add new one or uh, add, no, add custom service down here but we can actually just do that because it won't change this so when you have clicked that I don't know uh, okay, there we go. Um, you will give it a name, so I'm just gonna give it a test. Um, and then you would say 25565, like that. And you will select the PC it is for, or the device. So, what you need to do to find out about that, you need to do CMD. Um, right click it run as administrator click yes now you get to this window and it should say administrator command prompt and what you need to do then is do IP config like that and as you can see up here your IPv4 right there is a dot 11 as you can see mine down here I can also see the name of my PC is this one down here so I'm just gonna click that one and you're gonna click apply when you're done and that's actually it and you can all just close all of that but I have done it with the other server <coughs> as um, and uh, if we go into Minecraft uh, you can see right here Fatal Network, if we uh, double click this one, we will get into the server, oh, it's working perfectly fine, uh, we can go into factions, and uh, if you want to see how you, s uh, you can set up a bungee call server in the next video, just leave a comment, just need one person to say yes, I want bungee call server, or bungee call tutorial. And then I'll do it, so that would be absolutely fantastic, and that's actually it for this video. I just want to say some quick things before we I sign out. Um, this is my server, together uh, with Chris Place, we own this, and I'm hosting it, and huge shout out to him. 
for letting me be in this uh, cool community and just there will be a link so just go ahead everybody and subscribe to him because that would be amazing and guys we are so close to 100 subs it's insane we need we need like six subscribers more so if you could help me hit that just hit the subscribe button and hit the like button and i will see you in the next video goodbye